Hello everyone, it's Frank Snow, and after the recent events that brought snow to our lands, I thought I'd make a little vlog about the proper way to remove snow. Now the first thing you want to remember when you go out to remove snow is, you don't want to look good like this. You want to put on some warm clothing so you don't get frostbite, because frostbite's bad. It's like people that have sex with animals. So the first thing you want to do is dress up real warm. Time out. Let me get ready. So I'm back. As you can see, I have all my orifices warm. I'm wearing a standard hat, standard jacket, and standard gloves. Now, what we want to use to remove snow is a snow shovel. This is your standard snow shovel. You can tell it's a snow shovel because it has a long wooden stick and a loop on the end to pick the snow up. Now, the first thing you want to remember is proper snow training. You do not want to lift from your back. If you lift from your back, you could become a cripple, and cripples can't play sports, drive cars, walk up steps, and they usually die. So here's a wrong way to do it. Oh man, use your imagination that this is all snow. Oh man, here's the snow. I scoop it straight up. Didn't even bend my knees. Hurt my back. Now I'm in the hospital and I can't enjoy my life or my kids or my family or the snow. Now here's the proper way to do it. Take the snow. Arch your back. Scoop. Release. Scoop. Release. Scoop and release. Scoop and release. Scoop and release. And as you can see from our imaginary snow, it's now clear. So now I can walk there properly without slipping. Now here's another front view. You're in the snow now. Scoop. Release. Scoop, release. See how nice the pa the paved way is now in the driveway and you don't slip at all. There's Benjamin Franklin. He's walking without slipping on any ice. So that's the proper way to remove snow. So I hope you enjoyed my vlog. Thank you for visiting. And if you have any comments, feel free to leave them. Goodbye.